All right! Sharking with seaweed, this is how it's done. Here off of Miami with my boy. Sharking with seaweed! Seaweed! It's seaweed here from the YouTube channel Sharking with Seaweed. Today's episode, we're targeting snooks, snappers, and jacks, but we're not in the Florida Keys, we're in my old stomping grounds, where I grew up as a kid, climbing the jetties and catching snooks to take them to sell, to buy some food, to help my mom pay rent. On today's episode, we'll be using fresh pilchards and live pinfish. Hopefully we can net some mullet and give you a nice show with sharks, snappers, and jacks. You have to realize, fishing in the Florida Keys on my boat is completely different coming and fishing with buddies' boats here in Miami. In the Florida Keys, the bait is scarce. And in this clip, you see me throwing the cast net. I almost fall in the water. I completely, completely was tipped over, about to go head first in, and I threw my best throw, and we loaded up on Spanish sardines. They're like candy. So one of the tactics that we use is called el sandwich, the Cuban sandwich, which is one, two, up to eight sardines hooked through the eye, back through the gills with all the tails snapped off. You cast that out and it's like a ball of bait on the bottom. The little fish pick at it, but the big snooks and snappers come and take it away from the little fish. Get, 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 check, check, double header, double header. We're catching snooks and jacks, we get some bonus mangrove snappers. Here I am reeling in a nice bonus mangrove snapper. I caught one, my buddy Jack caught two, I think Gabe caught three. We got a nice little uh, bag limit of mangrove snappers to go along with those beautiful snooks that we released. All right, we caught a Cuban snapper, a Haitian yellowtail, but this one's going out for sharks. We got our shark bait, now we're gonna cast them out for a shark. Here we have a pesky nurse shark, which wasn't targeted. Off of camera, we were all joking. Anthony and Gabe, they were like, how does see we keep naming these things? And it comes with just years of fishing. When a shark or a fish that you have on the line is bobbing his head, bobbing his head, heavy and sluggish, nurse shark. When a fish is making your real scream and you're fishing by a jetty, it's probably gonna be a snook. When a fish is doing a little bit of both, it's probably gonna be a snapper. No, 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 it's a snook, it's a snook, it's a snook. Oh, 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 another one, oh, it's another one. Oh, oh you just heavy, bro. Let's go, Woo. baby. Sharking with seaweed. I think we have on a snook what we came here for. A nice little fight. We saw him jump by the rock. We came and conquered and did what we wanted to do, baby. Another one. Beautiful snook, Miami snook. We did everything that we set out to do. A different episode, a different location, no Florida Keys, mango snappers, lemon sharks, or yellowtails. Today we're in my old stomping grounds and we set out to catch snooks and snooks is what we gave you. We were able to catch them, remove those hooks and release them since it's out of season. We were also able to give you guys some mango snappers and some jacks and all together we got some great shots. 
We had Anthony with us tonight and we got some great video. I hope you guys liked it. Please, if you love the content, like, subscribe, share it. Share it with your mom, share it with your aunt, share it to your coworkers, share this stuff. This is how we keep bringing you videos. Talking with seaweed.